There's nothing like chilling with my girls. Just me and my divas taking over the world. It's your girl April, so today's video is going to be a really easy one. This is from EvaWigs.com. If you haven't heard of them, I've done quite a few videos. They also sell wigs as well as wefting hair closures, so you're not just restricted to just wigs. So this time around, I'm going to be doing a kind of like a silky texture. This one was ombre for me, and this is basically their basic styles, and I'll post the information below. Um, but these are styles that you can just choose from. Um, they are on the default at a certain length and color. However, if you want to customize it, you can. These are a little less ex inexpensive, so they're a little cheaper than the other wigs on the website. So this one here is 20 inches, and it's a 1B with a chestnut brown. I'm going to tell you this. They did a great color on um, this wig. The dye job is really, really pretty. It is a little thin on the thin side for me, so I did cut a little bit of layers in the front to it, as well as I put just some big wand curls in it to give it some volume and just fullness because I love volume. But it's a really easy wig. It's a glueless lace wig, so there are combs attached in the front as well as the adjustable strap. You see that I've already posted mine or put my straps as tight as they can go. Um, when I first got the wig, it was kind of uniform curls from Factory Curls, so I did wash it because I wanted to put my own part in it. And it's really best to put your part in while the hair is wet after you've conditioned it or while it's conditioning. You can go ahead and take your old part out or just put a part in and just brush the hair in the direction that you want the part to go and that's just the basic easiest way and method to part your hair unless you want to sit there and gel it hairspray it I think that washing it is the best way so first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to put some concealer the knots I noticed were bleached as well on this but I'm just going to use some concealer because I just want a little more coverage I want it to look a little more realistic I'm going to be using my Beauty Treats palette, which is um, super cheap. I'll post the information below where you can get this from. It's from IK House. But yes, I love this palette. It reminds me a lot of the Coastal Scents palette, um, which is basically the same. So I'm just going to place the concealer where my part is at on the inner portion of the wig. So for the outside, the brush is going to be a lot smaller, and that's just to get into the part better. You don't want it all over your hair. Um, you can do it while it's either on your head or off. I like to do it both ways. So here is the concealer on the outer portion. As well as that, if you want $35 off, you can use code Muffin is my lovers for you, the number four in the work and the letter U, and I'll post that information for you as well at the time of checkout so you can save $35. So yes, you guys, let's get this going. there you have it ladies so like I said this was a really easy wig to style there was only a little piece of lace that you had to cut off in the front 
which made it really easy. But like I said, it's a little thin for my taste. I do like a lot of hair, so I went ahead and cut some layers in it just a little bit to frame my face. But I also teased the hair. I didn't have my teasing comb on hand, so I just used a regular comb and just teased it down and gave it some volume on the top. And then you girls already know. Aussie Instant Freeze is a must-have. This is one of the best hairsprays by far. I love it. I always say that. It is a needed product. If you have hairspray, you love hairspray, then I would highly suggest the Aussie Instant Freeze in the aerosol can. You can pick this up anywhere. Walmart, Target, Kmart, CVS, Walgreens, Rite Aid, the supermarket, you name it. Aussie products are sold everywhere and they've been around forever. So that is one of my go-to products. I have a couple of bottles in the stash. So it makes the hair freeze instantly. It's not super hard. It's not really hard. But it's a nice fullness and it gives it a nice freeze to where your curls don't fall all day. You're able to spray them and you don't have like helmet hair. Like, you know, that stiff hair. But it keeps your style in place. So this is 20 inches in length. So I went a little shorter this time. You know, you don't always have to have it so long. But I love Eva wigs because they have like a variety of things. Plus their customer service is so just really, really great. They're very, very nice people. Um, but yes, a glueless lace wig. Girls, you can rock this all day. And as you see, my part, I really didn't need to use a lot of my favorite topic, keratin hair filler fibers. And it's probably because I already had some in my hair from the past few days. So sometimes it does last depending on what I'm doing with my hair. Especially if it's freshly washed, it will last a lot longer in your hair. But very easy wig to style. The hair is silky straight and it's easy to curl. Like I said, I used the hugest barrel in my Irresistible Me 8 Interchangeable Curly Wand set. I love that set. And I just twisted the hair around it and made these big beachy waves. It gives the hair some style, but it also gives it fullness as well. It's just like regular curls. You basically do whatever kind of curls you want. But for me, that just takes less time to do the curls like this. So, I will post all the information for Eva Wigs down below. As well as the coupon code if you want to take $35 off. Use Muffin Is My Lovers for you at the time of checkout. And as always. If you're interested in a unit to be custom made, you can always check out my website, goingwiththewindwigs.webly.com, which will also be posted below along with video units are also for sale. But I will be posting some new ones, so just get, um, just bear with me. So on that note, I hope you guys have a great holiday. Let me know what you think of this unit. I'll post a link for this one below, and as well as that, stay diva and divalicious, and I'll see you guys in my next video.